Hello, everybody. You know what today is, don't you? Don't tell me you forgot. It's Coffee Shop Thursday. Hmm. Only today is a special Coffee Shop Thursday. It is also Turkey Day Thursday. Thanksgiving. Happy Thanksgiving to you all. Just wanted to share with you a quick look at one of the psalms that is assigned to this day because I know you have to be in the kitchen getting that turkey ready and the stuffing and the pies and all that kind of good stuff so hey let's just look real quickly at Psalm 65 the end of it as you read it hey it's this tells you why it is assigned to this day you visit the earth and water it you greatly enrich it the river of God is full of water you provide the people with grain, for so you have prepared it. You water its furrows abundantly, settling its ridges, softening it with showers and blessing its growth. You crown the year with your bounty. Your wagon tracks overflow with riches. The pastures of the wilderness overflow. The hills gird themselves with joy. The meadows clothe themselves with flocks. The valleys deck themselves with grain. They shout and sing together for joy. I can just see an artist painting on a canvas right about now, couldn't you? And all these beautiful pastoral type scenes and farm scenes. And remember, this is a society that depends on agriculture a great deal. Oh, we still do today, although we don't often see it because we're stuck in cities and villages. But hey, it's out there. And it's beautiful scenery of the, the abundance of the harvest. And that's why it is a harvest psalm. It was one that probably was sung at one of those times when the people were journeying to Jerusalem, going to the temple, and they would be just singing this song for joy. But you know, I read the end of the psalm. You know what really gives us our reason for celebrating? It's not just the abundance, because there could be years of scarcity. Yeah, they had years of drought and times, times got tough from time to time. But here's the real reason that we celebrate. It comes at the very beginning of the Psalm. Praise is due to you, O God in Zion, and to you shall our vows be performed. O you who answer prayer. You who answer prayer? To you all flesh shall come when deeds of iniquity overwhelm us. You forgive our transgressions. That's the real reason we come and offer our prayers of thanksgiving and our songs of praise. Because God looks down upon us and is a gracious, loving, forgiving God. It's not mentioned specifically in this psalm but we all know that word that i've been telling you time and time and time again that hebrew word hesed god's abundant love for you and for me that's what fills our lives that's what gives us a real reason for thanksgiving have a great day celebrate give thanks to god and may his blessings overflow abundantly in your life. See you later.